Greetings, Faith Family, and thank you for joining me on this midweek update. Hard to believe, but Easter is quickly approaching. Now, if you have an opportunity and you're out and about, we are looking for plastic, uh, plastic eggs and candy because we are having an Easter egg hunt here at the church on Sunday, March 24th. So after the second service, we're going to have that Easter egg hunt, and uh, we're inviting the daycare families to join us. So this is a Faith United Methodist Church event, but we're inviting the community, we're inviting the, the daycare families to join us. And, uh, and so we would, we would love your, your participation by donating plastic eggs and, and candy, and, and also just be there March 24th. It's Palm Sunday. Join us for worship. Um, we're having uh, uh, at least one baptism uh, at the end of that service. It's going to be a baptism of, of immersion. And so at the end of the service, we'll be going into the fellowship hall for the baptism. And so if anyone else out there would like to be baptized, uh, whether that is sprinkled or immersed in the United Methodist Church, we believe baptism is, is an outward and visible sign of an inward and spiritual grace. And so we, uh, we recognize both sprinkling and immersing, but we will have some immersions. And so if you are interested in baptism or if you know someone who is, please contact me here at the church. Um, I would appreciate it. Uh, that way we could talk about it beforehand. But again, March 24th, which is Palm Sunday, um, right after second service, we are having an Easter egg hunt. But uh, toward the end of that ser service, we're also going to be going into the fellowship hall for, uh, for an immersion, for a baptism. And so, uh, so it should be an exciting Sunday. So I hope you can join us for that. This coming Saturday, we're continuing our Lenten series of uh, Saturday morning breakfasts. We've been meeting at different churches just for a time of food, fellowship, and program. It does not last more than an hour, and this Saturday it's going to be at Jamestown United Methodist Church. That is at 8.30. It will be done by 9.30. On March 21st, that's a Thursday, we have our next senior lunch. We're meeting at Bill's. And so if you'd like to join us, please RSVP to the church office so we can make arrangements at Bill's. So that is March 21st, Bill's Barbecue for Senior Lunch. And then on March 22nd, we are having Parents' Night Out. That is a Friday. And so if you want to sign up, you can sign up at our church website, faithumc.com. You can see Tyler Do. You can call the church office if you have more information about that. <clears throat> but you can drop your kiddos off and then go out for, uh, for a date night, uh, March 22nd. Also, just have a, a prayer request. Please pray for the family of Joe Williams. He passed away last week. But his services are tomorrow, Thursday, here at the church. There's going to be viewing from noon until 3 and then a celebration of life at 3 p.m., tomorrow. Well, I think that's that's all I've got. Again, uh, March 21st, Palm Sunday, we're having some baptisms. If you have never been baptized and would like to, uh, please contact me and we can talk about that. I'm always excited about baptisms. This coming Sunday, we're, we're continuing a sermon series entitled Jesus's Final Week. We're looking at the last week of Jesus's life and what we'll be studying this coming Sunday is Jesus and the disciples in the garden of Gethsemane. So I hope you can join us this Sunday, 8.30 or 10.45. We do live stream the 10.45 service. Well, I hope you have a great day. Enjoy this beautiful day that God has given to us and let us pray. Most gracious God, I thank you for this day. I thank you for your presence. I thank you for this Lenten season as you draw us closer unto you as we prepare for the celebration of Easter Sunday. Dear God, I just uh, I pray for the hearts and the souls and the minds who are watching this, uh, whenever they're watching this, today or another day. Dear God, I pray that you will bless them. Dear God, stir our hearts that if there is someone who has never been baptized, but they want to make that profession of faith, that they will contact me. Because, dear God, we, we believe in that life-changing um, anointing of your Holy Spirit and the special, the special anointing of baptism. Dear God, uh, I just pray for the Joe Williams family. I pray for Beth, for the, for the girls, for the family. I pray that you will comfort them as only you can. Dear God, I pray that you'll be with us tomorrow as we celebrate his life. And I do thank you for Joe and all that he meant to so many people. But dear God, I pray for those at home that you'll anoint them today. Dear God, I pray that you will mend brokenness. I pray that you will heal sickness. I pray that you will stand beside those who are lonely. 
Dear God, I also pray that uh, as we come to you in thanksgiving and praise, that we will know that you are a God who listens to our hearts. Dear God, we thank you for all these things. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless. Have a, have a great day.